Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be testing out the Magic Mixies refill pack. I've been wanting to do this for some time. It looks like you get some mist reveals, some spells inside. I have fully charged our cauldron. Luna's joining us who is my cute little original Magic Mixies and I've loaded the cauldron with a blind bag, so that container you get in the original cauldron, you can put it something inside of it, load it back up, and we're going to see if it works. If everything works according to plan, then we will have a fun blind bag to open as well. So let's go ahead and get started. The refill packs are sold separately. I found mine at Walmart, and it kind of gives you a, an idea of some of the things included. So I think you can do separate like spell ones without the mist, but we want to go for the mist for sure. Okay. Oh, there's your little potion. Interesting. Let's get these out. So you have your little vial of liquid, and then we have a book wishing spell with all of its ingredients separated, which is kind of nice. And then we have the green luck spell, also nicely separated. And then you have your separate instruction manual. You also have a QR code to scan to watch a video on how to refill your cauldron. And this vial here is the refill for the mist. Since I have a blind bag inside, we're gonna try a luck spell and see if we can get lucky with our reveal. So here's all our little packets laid out. I like how number four is your, your lucky clover. We also have number one being your water. And then you wanna make sure you put your Magic Mixie Cauldron to create mist, because you also have a function of spell, but no mist. So this one should also generate the mist after we've added in our little mist potion. So here we go. Step one, you have your water, you fill it in, and then listen for the tap sound. You can hear it's bubbling. Let me... There we go. <laughs> it tapped. So then you tap the cauldron three times. Now we go on to step two, which it says give your wish luck and you add the sound dust. So in that goes. It's like a bath fizzy. <laughs> and you're gonna stir your potion around and also listen for the tap sound. There you go, so you tap back three times. And then you move on to step three. It says, make your spell precious. And you're pouring in liquid sapphire. So here we go, here's our liquid sapphire. That's a pretty blue. Give that a stir as well. It's also very fizzy. <laughs> Got our three taps. We tap three times. And then next step is We have a different sound there. Make your luck appear with potion number four, and it says drop in the four leaf clover. Oh, how cute! So here is our four leaf clover. In you go for luck. You can also stir that around. You can see it floating in there. So let's dissolve that. Okay, that's really cool. That might be my favorite step of thus far. And you can see the light inside, although I, I shouldn't have tipped it. <laughs> There's our tap. I brought the cauldron closer. Oops. 
so you can see the light so we got to tap three times And we move on to spell number five, which is make your spell blossom and add the forever flower, which is a nice hot pink color. So let's get this one. Cute. So it is a flower shape. So in you go, forever flower. You can watch it dissolve and spread. That's actually kind of fun. <laughs> Give it a little stir to, to speed things up. Got some really pretty colors going on. Okay, the tap is ready for us to tap back. You can kind of still feel the flower, but it will dissolve. Okay, then spell number six is to make the spell strong, you add the dragon scales. And I really like the flames on, on this one. So let's open this up. I'm just going to cut it. Oops, did that fall in the cauldron? My bad. <laughs> Don't want plastic in your cauldron. Okay, so here are the dragon scales. They're actual little paper pieces. Let me cut this open a little bit more so we can see them better. Oh yeah, so they're individual little scales. So we'll sprinkle those in. The little flames. Get all your dragon scales in there. And then give it a stir so they can dissolve as well. Okay, those were our taps. The cauldron's rushing us. <laughs> it's, it's ready to go. So here we go. Okay. Nice. So spell number seven is name your wish. So it says, write your wish on the scroll and then drop it into the cauldron which this is how we named Luna. So because I put a blind bag inside, I'm just gonna name our wish Lucky. And hopefully we get lucky with this. So in you go, Lucky. And then let's stir it up. And we heard the tap. We have a purple light on the bottom. And then we will tap three times and hopefully have our reveal. Cool, and we're supposed to say Magicus Mix Us and we've got lots, lots of sounds going on. Oh, that's so awesome. So it's working guys. We've got a lot of our mist. Oh, this is so fun. This would be so cool for Halloween time. Which we're halfway to Halloween pretty much, right? A lot of mist. And again, it's made of the glycerin vegetable oil. So it does have a little scent to it. Okay, here we go. Okay, so it did turn over. Let's clear the mist. Oh, this is so cool. So I loaded it correctly, which was actually pretty easy to do. And then inside you grab the container, the original gem case. So this is where I put our blind bag. And inside I put a waterproof blind bag, just in case if things went, went wrong. <laughs> we have a Sailor Moon Series 2 figural key ring. 
I figured my original magic mixie I named Luna and of course Luna's Sailor Moon's cat so I figured you know what this would be a good test to see if it worked and it would be really cool to get Sailor Chibi Moon since she's pink and I think Luna would like her too. I think there's a chance to get the Luna ball as well. Okay, so let's see how lucky we were. You really can't go wrong with any figure. I love them all. So let's just hope for Sailor Chibi Moon. And inside, oh, we have Neo Queen Serenity, which you know what? That is pretty lucky too. Sailor Chibi Moon's mom. And that is such a gorgeous and whimsical figure and still works really well with our little magical Luna. Oh, she's absolutely beautiful. I, I love these. <laughs> and there's her little crescent moon. <laughs> so there you have our refill packed. Everything works smoothly, smoother than expected. It was very easy um, to use to refill. Our figure didn't get wet. It, it, it's all good. Plus in the refill pack, you have one more spell. You have the book wishing spell. And of course, if you can, um, if you don't want the mist to appear, you don't have to use this part because this gets preloaded into it. So you can also just do the little spell without the mist, your choice. That was fun. I'm really glad I bought the refill pack. And again, I could see various uses for this and little surprises along the way. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up and I want to thank you guys so so much for watching I really appreciate it and I hope to see you next time until then take care bye bye